let's discuss one of the most significant turning point in India's agricultural history, the Green Revolution. This transformative movement not only helped India achieve food security but also modernized agriculture. Let's start with a simple question. What do you think the term Green Revolution means? The Green Revolution refers to a period during the 1960s and 1970s when India witnessed a significant increase in agricultural productivity due to modern farming techniques. The Green Revolution was initiated in the mid-1960s, which is to address severe food shortages and chronic hunger, which was led by the Dr. M. S. Swaminathan often called the father of the green revolution in India. This moment introduced high yielding variety seeds, modern irrigation system and chemical fertilizers. It was supported by the government of India and international agencies like the Ford Foundation and also inspired by agricultural success in countries like Mexico. Why do you think India needed the green revolution? majorly for increased food grain production. Just imagine when a country cannot produce enough food for its people, which it leads to hunger, malnutrition and dependency on other nations, right? So the primary objective of the Green Revolution was to increase food grain production, particularly wheat and rice. These were staple crops for the majority of population in India and it also aimed to become self-sufficient in food production and reduce the risk associated with shortages because during the 1950s and 1960s, India depended heavily on food aid, especially through the programs like PL480 from the United States. This dependency was unsustainable and often came with political strings attached. The Green Revolution aimed to reduce reliance on imports by boosting domestic production making India more self-resilient. Who do you think benefits the most when agricultural productivity increases? especially the farmers in the rural areas, right? The third objective of Green Revolution was to sought to enhance rural livelihoods by improving farmers' incomes with better seeds, fertilizers and irrigation methods. Farmer could achieve higher yields and earn more. This not only improved their quality of life but also contributed to the overall development of rural India. Agriculture in India was traditionally labor-intensive and dependent on monsoon. The Green Evolution aimed to modernize agriculture by introducing advanced tools, technique and technology to make farmers more efficient. So this modernization made farming more efficient and less dependent on unpredictable weather conditions. Don't you think food security is important for a country like India? Yes, because food security ensures that everyone has access to sufficient and nutritious food, preventing hunger and malnutrition. Where in the India's growing population during the mid 20th century required a reliable food supply. So the Green Revolution aimed to ensure food security by increasing agricultural productivity with adequate food production. The country could feed its population and reduce the risk of hunger and malnutrition. Let's discuss about key features of the Green Revolution. The Green Revolution introduced modern agricultural practices such as high yielding variety seeds, where IRH rice and Kalyan Sona wheat were introduced. These seeds produced higher yields than traditional varieties. Secondly, chemical fertilizers and pesticides introduced, where chemical fertilizers boosted soil fertility while pesticides controlled pests and diseases. Irrigation infrastructure which expanded irrigation system like tube wells and channels with advanced techniques like sprinklers were also introduced. Mechanization, use of tractors, harvesters also improved farming efficiency. Let's look into the government support and policies. Initial development were 
the creation of agricultural university and research institutes for r&d development main secondly minimum support price msp which ensure fair prices for farmers encouraging adoption of hyv seeds subsidies for the farmers where financial aid for fertilizers irrigation system and farm equipment credit schemes which provided loans to farmers for purchasing modern tools and inputs do you think the green revolution benefited all parts of the india equally no it was more successful in certain regions the green revolution had the greatest impact in regions with better irrigation and infrastructure like punjab haryana and western uttar pradesh were the primary benefiters however it had limited impact in rain fed and underdeveloped regions now let's move into the impact of green revolution so increased food grain production which made india become self sufficient in food grains by the mid 1970s food production increased from 50 million tons in 1950 1951 to over 200 million tons by the 1990s reduction in hunger and imports dependency on foreign food aid decreased significantly economic growth which boosted rural income and agricultural gdp technical advancement modernized indian agriculture through mechanization and scientific practices creation of surplus which enabled the establishment of the public distribution system and food grain exports green revolution also faced several challenges majorly was environmental degradation where soil fertility loss salinization and water logging due to the intensive farming second sustainability over reliance on chemical inputs which led to the natural resource depletion and marginalized farming small farmers struggle to afford hyv seeds fertilizers and machineries overproduction surplus grains led to storage and distribution issues what steps can we take to address the challenges of green revolution primarily promote sustainable agriculture by adapting eco-friendly practices like organic farming and integrated pest management secondly diversify crops focus on pulses oil seeds and horticulture to meet nutritional needs third support marginal farmers by providing affordable access to technology and inputs for small scale farmers improve regional equity extended agricultural advancements to underdeveloped regions finally invest in research and development which helps to develop a climate resilient crop and efficient irrigation technique considering green revolution a turning point in indian agriculture which transformed india from a food deficient country to a self sufficient one it modernized agriculture increased food production and boosted rural livelihoods however it also exposed challenges like environmental degeneration and social inequality moving forward sustainable practices and inclusive policies are essential for balanced agricultural growth thank you for watching don't forget to like comment share and subscribe